Welcome to another edition of Lazing is Amazing with Dr. Glenn Benass. Today we're going to talk about the Picasso Disposable Tips. They come in a box here in, in assorted sizes and uh, in assorted quantities of 25 in each box. They can come in 0, 45, and 90 degree shapes. The lengths are 5 to 10 millimeters. The anterior can be used for the front for canker sores and oral lesions. The 45 and 90 degrees are used in the posterior of the mouth and typically I like the 90 degrees 10 millimeter for most of my procedures including crown troughing. You can see here all the tips including on the top row the disposable tips and on the bottom row the bleaching tip that you see here which is an only non-disposable tip. It must be used with the Picasso 7 watt. Here we have the low level laser tip which has an 8 millimeter lens used for canker sores. The straight tips are used in the front for things like anterior gingivectomies and venous lakes. Here we see the 45 degree tips which come in 5 and 10 millimeter lengths can be used for gingival troughing and the 90 degrees which have a thicker neck to them. You can tell which tip is which on the back of the package as you see here it says 400 O9, which is a 400 micron, 9 millimeter, 90 degree tip. When you're looking at your tips, the first thing to make sure is that your fiber is firmly connected to the back of your unit. After this, you want to make sure that it's firmly connected and that then you look at the connection of the tips. Here we see the tips as they should look with a cannula and the tip connected firmly to it. You see here the three parts, including the tip, the cannula, and the metal sheath. Make sure that the cannula is firmly seated into the uh, metal sheath on the multi-tip handpiece. As you see here, that there is no gaps. Usually the blue cannula and the tip are connected, but you want to make sure again that this is firm, as not here, where the connection, you can see the metal showing between the cannula and the tip, but here it is firm in place and the aiming beam is coming out. I hope this has been in instructive in learning a little bit more about your Picasso light and the choice of tips that you have for your unit. Until next time, remember to keep lazing. It's amazing. Goodbye.